My name is Saurav Shrestha. Well, I'm from Team Baha. So uh, our scenario is scenario to earthquake and uh, landslide prone areas. So our location is uh, a remote uh, settlement in a Himalayan region of Nepal. The basic premise of our housing design is, uh, is based on like critical reflection of what we have seen in terms of post-disaster earthquake reconstruction. Like the housing is, uh, was delivered as a product and uh, we are thinking of an alternative way of providing a housing where uh, housing becomes a process where we enable users to design themselves. The mainstream idea about resilience is uh, concerned more with the building structure, but we have uh, thought uh, more on the building process as well as uh, building form. So our building form is regular and our building structure is uh, structurally coherent and our building process uh, allows expandability and a speedy recovery in case of uh, the disaster as well. So uh, the interesting thing about our project is that we have uh, used situated construction knowledge and the local material. Like as I said, we have uh, designed for a remote area in a Himalayan region. So you cannot take materials uh, with uh, transport. There's, there are no better transport. So you have to uh, rely on local materials for that. So we are using local materials like stone and timber. So our structural system is a, is a timber module. Uh, that is repeated and we are using uh, also local manpower. We have enabled the user with a structural module. So we are not designing the entire house. We are giving them a structural module so that uh, a user can adapt that structural module uh, to, ex to expand or to have a house of their need. Our structural module can adapt with any of the local vernacular style and we can make uh, like uh, we can create a various typologies of houses so that the houses don't become like a mass housing with a series of blocks. It becomes like a true village. In, in competition, we have much more freedom uh, to experiment and to innovate. That's something that we, uh, we value. Like it's, it's more like doing something for the cause that you believe. So that's why we really enjoyed working for this design competition than for any other project. About the challenge, I really liked seeing all the design of other scenarios as well. There was so much to learn, like uh, how different uh, structures are adapting to different kinds of risk and how uh, the various types of approaches have created a like, series of resilient homes. So there's no a generic type of building, but like a lot of variation on typologies of houses and it was a great learning experience as a whole, I think.